Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I am going to show you how to make a mandala pattern or art in Affinity Designer for iPad. It's really simple, it's really quick, you're gonna learn it really really fast, so just uh, stay tuned. Okay, first thing you need to do is of course open up your app. You have to have Affinity Designer and of course iPad and um, regarding the size the ratio should be one by one okay one by one so first thing you do is you choose this little rectangle tool and you gotta make sure that the snapping is on right here so after you have snapping on and you grab the rectangle tool you're just gonna start dragging the rectangle from the left corner on the top until it snaps in the middle and that's it so it needs to snap exactly in the middle and then I'm just gonna make it invisible and you can leave the little little border just the tiny little bit I like to see where it ends but you don't need to do that so after we made our first rectangle, uh, you need to select it and you go here into the symbol studio. If you don't know where it is, you can always press this little question mark and you're gonna find here it is, symbols studio. So you go into the symbol studio, press this little hamburger menu and add symbol from selection. So this rectangle needs to be selected. Add symbol from selection. Okay, so you cannot see it right here because it's invisible, but it's here in this section. After we done that, while it's still selected, I'm just gonna press with two fingers and duplicate this um, rectangle. So now you have two. Then I'm gonna do the same until I have four and every single one needs to snap correctly into its space okay so now when you have four rectangles i'm gonna select this one and go to the transform studio and flip it so just one tap one flip that's a horizontal flip for this one right here you flip it horizontally and vertically and for this one right here you just flip it vertically and that's it this one you don't touch now that you have all four uh, symbols now you can not see but there is four symbols right here you can see it here in the la layers panel now you can start drawing so you need to go into the layers and select the rectangle because otherwise you will not get the mirror uh, mirror effect let me just choose the brush tool and let's do it. Ah, see it works already so you choose the settings right here and you can start drawing right. and it's gonna copy in every single rectangle you made before and what is fun about this it's completely it's completely vector so if you don't like anything you did you can edit it like see it changes everywhere super useful you want to move on make sure you're here in the symbol and you're on top of the last layer you made 
so I'm just grabbing my brush once again and I'm making another one whoops I missed this one undo see now this one I would like to be here just move it so easy You can play around with this as much as you want. You can do so much art and so many uh, different patterns and um, interesting stuff. So please let me know if everything is um, working for you and do you like it and if this was helpful you can uh, remove the border completely and now it's invisible but everything you do still it will copy you can also add shapes and you can play around and you can draw in any of the symbols it doesn't have to be this top left one it can be any any one of these so let me know what you think this was super quick super easy tutorial and I hope it's gonna be helpful to you guys if it is, please like and subscribe and uh, check, up, check out my other videos and I'll see you in my next one. Okay, bye bye!